Should Serbia be banned from this year's Eurovision Song Contest because of pro-Russian rallies? Last night, up to 4,000 people have taken part in pro-Russia demonstrations in the Serbian capital, Belgrade. Friday's march was a show of support for Moscow after its invasion of Ukraine. And least we forget, Serbia has religious, ethnic and political ties with Russia that have existed for centuries. But of course, we should stress that 4,000 people out of a population of just over 6 million, it isn't a lot. Now, whilst yes, well, of course, we can understand the argument for Belarus to also be excluded from this year's Eurovision Song Contest, considering they kind of already are. Uh, and of course, Russia buggering off because of the fact that they started the whole thing. Should Serbia join suit? <sighs> I'm torn on this one. And whilst, yes, it looks absolutely super, super bad, super, super bad, and super horrific of what Serbia have just done last night. It just feels like it's only a tiny portion of the country that are sort of in favour of Russia. And maybe we could see some opposite protests going on in the country and saying pro-Ukraine instead. But of course, if we don't hear anything, then um, I for one am perfectly fine for Serbia buggering off as well, if you ask me. But that's if we don't hear anything further. Otherwise, let me know in the comments below what you think of it all. It's a very short video, but I would love to dearly hear from you what you think. Should Serbia be banned from this is your vision as well? or give them a little bit of a pass uh, just about on this occasion. Otherwise, you know the drill by now. Smash the like button as good as hard as you can. Subscribe for more of my Eurovision juicy goodness and ring the bell to get notified about my latest videos. Catch you in the next one. Bye.